A cafe owner in Washington state is taking heat now for kicking out two mothers and their children. Rainy McDuff says uh, she asked them to leave her small cafe because one of the children was having a screaming fit. Well, McDuff then uh, took a picture of the crumbs the group left under the table and then posted it on Facebook. And it included a sarcastic comment saying this, I'd like to I'd like to rather take this time to thank our customers with small children who don't make messes. Somebody threatened to drag me behind their truck. No, I don't know what we're I've had people that. threatening to picket my business. Oh my. Uh, all right, so guess what? Um, there's more to this story. Turns out the moms that Miss McDuff kicked out were military moms. And McDuff says um, she's sorry that she posted the pictures, but she adds that the moms are welcome back, just not the children. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this just gets crazier and crazier. Yeah, ouch. Etocracy uh, editor Kat Kinsman joining me now from New York. So, <laughs> Kat, you know, Ooh. people were angry about that Facebook uh, picture and then I guess the sarcastic note, right? Very There's, angry. They Oh, they sure were. And it kind of hit the, the trifecta for online outrage because you have restaurant service, <laughs> other people's parenting decisions, and misuse of social media. So oh. they were commenting all over the place, including things like, I hope you don't, you don't run a business if you can't take what comes along with it. I hope you don't have children. I hope your BS closes your doors. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, and the, but on the flip side, other hey, wait a minute. The cafe is called Rainy Cafe. Her name's They Rainey. don't just want sunny customers, sunny days. <laughs> she herself is a military wife, so you know that goes into the equation. But on the, on the flip side, people were defending her, saying, good for you for calling out that messy family. Parents need to know that it's not all right for their children to make messes and not pick up after them. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Well, I guess, you know, there, there's, a, there's quite the food fight going on there, a little bit from everyone being lobbed. So, uh, you know, I, I guess what's your advice then, whether it be to restaurateurs or to patrons? I mean, how do we all just get along here? Well, for the restaurant tours, I, I speak at a conference every year talking to restaurant owners about how to use social media. Above all, err on the side of positive. Don't call out your customers because for everybody you think is, is on your side, you're going to be alienating somebody else. So mm -hmm. be really careful what you say in public like that. And for parents, you can, you know, you can really teach your kid to be a good restaurant patron. Yeah. And we talked to a lot of chefs about this. You can play restaurant at home and teach them etiquette and sort of what is expected of them. You can also position it as being a treat, not as well, you have to dress up and you have to go mm -hmm. and, and sit in and sit still and be quiet for all this time. And um, you really want to call, make sure that the place is kid friendly as well. Yeah. You don't want to take them somewhere where they'll be sitting stiffly and really uncomfortable. But um, here, more than anything, call the restaurant and tell them you're coming. Because, <laughs> well, because, and this, Warning, this, I've got out of control children. I'll be there I, in 10 minutes. <laughs> well, actually, I say more on the side of, you know, a lot of, of chefs and restaurateurs are parents themselves. And they're looking to this as their future customers really yeah. so a little bit of communication can go a really really long way